Hello, my name is Alan Martel. I am a postdoctoral researcher at the School of Library and Information Science at Louisiana State University. Today, I am going to show you how to create backups of your chats in WhatsApp. To start, first we need to go to WhatsApp. So, we go to the app, and now I am going to show you how to backup messages using the chat with my friend Frank. First, I tap on the specific chat, and there is Frank. Now, I go to settings. Next, I go to more. Next, I go to export chat. Now, we're going to see two ways of doing this. First, we're going to see how to export the chat without any media and then with media. So, without media. And now, for this first try, we're going to send it to Outlook. You can see that there are different ways in which you could save up your backup. I type my email address and you can see that the export the chat is an attachment in the message. So I click send. Now that I have exported the chat, I am just going to verify that I got it correctly. So I'm going to go to my browser my inbox and there I'm going to have the chat with my friend Frank. Then I'm going to download it. Then I am going to open the folder and there it is. So our next step is to export the same chat but with media. So I am going to go here. Again, I am going to open the message with my friend Frank. And I am going to go to more, export, chat. And this time I am going to export it with media. Now I am going to export it to the drive. Do this. And you will see that there are a series of GIF images that uh, show up here in the list in addition to the log. The log of the chat, that is the text messages that my friend Frank and I have been sending back and forth, those appear as a plain text file with the extension txt and the GIF, uh, which is the multimedia component in the chat, uh, those you will see them with the extension mp4. So now I'm going to click save. All right, now we're going to verify that the export to the drive was successful. So I am going to open my browser and open the drive. There we go. You can see here all the MP4s have been exported and also the plain text file with the text messages uh, with Frank. Now, if I scroll down, I can also see them listed here. And I exported this twice just in case. That's why you see twice the same message. And so if I open it up, you can see the messages with my friend Frank. That concludes our tutorial.